I promise I'll do whatever it takes to make sure our family, and Zoe, yourself, and the family that one, way, one day we will create together are all provided for. But most importantly, I promise to love you as the man that I am and the man that I wish to be. I love you, Heather. With you, I vow every day to just do better and be better, both individually and as a couple. I promise to always live in the present with you to not take any moment for granted. And the love that you give me is something I hope that every person gets to experience once in their life. So this reading is inspired partly by the Game of Thrones and partly by uh, Uncle Derry's dragon. I like this dragon, thought the lovely other dragon. Although he is fierce, he is also tender and he is funny. He is also quite clever, though I will not tell him this for now. I like this lovely other dragon, thought the dragon. She is beautiful, and she is different, and she smells so nice. She is also a free spirit, which is a quality I much admire in another dragon. Let us all be dragons and lovely other dragons together, for the sun is warm and the world is a beautiful place. And with luck, all your hopes and your dreams can be real. May success find its way to your hearts. Tomorrow can bring you the greatest of joys, but today is the day it also has. I love you both. Family and friends, it is my pleasure and honor to present to you the newlywed couple, Heather and Gary Lombard. <laughs> Gary, you may now Kiss your bride. Over the past 10 years, I have watched my father and Heather's relationship grow and evolve into what I can only describe as an incredible love story. I was blown away when you asked me to be your best man and honored at the same time to 
be up here right by your side as you go through this wonderful experience is an absolute privilege. I can now see why my entire life I have been told how lucky I am to be your son, because that is simply the truth. I cannot wait to see where we go from here. You are a great man. You are a great father. You're going to make a great husband. There's no one else in this world I would rather call my dad. And there's no one else who deserves the title of my best friend. That man right there. Some of you may know me as Little Heather. Growing up, Heather was always very expressive, whether it was through art, dancing, singing Bleeding Love by Leona Lewis over and over and over again, until the song could have been called Bleeding Ears. She still dances, except now, instead of her bedroom, she leaves everyone in awe in the dance floor. She still sings, but now she sings Disney songs in her living room with the people and person she loves. And she still continues to be the most significant person in my life. We've always had a special bond, but our relationship only grows stronger with every year. She is definitely my rock. 